Hello everyone, I'm the Mole Man and welcome to Rochester. Yeah, we're in Rochester right now and we've got this bad boy. The fastest passenger train that I own. Let's open the doors so people can get on. There we go. Froze the game for some weird re reason. Now, the problem I have with this train so far is um, it's so wide, as you'll see from probably from the back here the best, that on corners other trains start to collide with it. I tried loading this in at a different station and the train just, it kind of just pushed mine off the track because it's so wide, so that's going to be fun. But the whole idea today is to see how quickly we can get to St Pancras International. 30 miles, it's the fastest train I own. So th this, this should be interesting. Are the doors still open? Yeah. And now they're not. Right, let's put the lights on. No, I said let's put the lights on. There we go, that's a lot of lights. Also, the horn won't work. It only works on the route that this train is meant to be on. Don't ask. Right. Here we go. This train goes pretty quick. I'm gonna say it now. And if we come up against any other AI trains, we might not survive. In which case, I'll have to pick a different station to start at. Now we are going to stick to the limits here because we will derail, but as soon as we get onto a straight piece of track, we, we will just go. This train, just, I love this train. It's brilliant. It's the closest train simulator has to a Japanese bullet train. Oh god, there's another train coming. This could go interesting. See, look, if you look here, you can see how small the gap is. And it's it's rather... Yeah, sometimes it collides. Like it did earlier. And causes a major problem and pushes my train off the track. So let's hope that doesn't happen often, eh? But this is, you know... That bridge just popped in, as it normally does. So yeah, this train is very, very nice indeed. I can't remember its name. But it's got cruise control. We won't be using that today. We'll just be using 100% throttle. But yeah, we're just about to go over the Medway Bridge. And it seems to be glitching out a bit. It's just not loading in properly. If we go to that camera, it's loaded in fine. Sort of. It's very realistic, this. It's very well modelled, this bridge. Because I kind of live, live in this sort of area-ish. Right, here's where the problem lies. This is a very tight corner around here. If a train comes along, we are going to get pushed off, probably. We won't see it, because it, the, the game's stupid like that. Alright, let's just leave it on a slow percentage. Yeah, this train's very um, finicky about where you put the controls. It's not very accurate. You push the button, it goes wherever it wants it to go. Yeah, look at that, though. That just looks awesome. With it's going down. Yeah, this is a pantograph train, but who cares? We can do what we want with it. Also, this train doesn't have any annoying alarms. Yeah, we're speeding. Doesn't really matter. We're not going to be stopping until we get to St Pancras. Look at all those lovely people. And we are we are clipping through the station, but you know we shall ignore that. Because, you know, otherwise it's too realistic and screw that. This does look awesome though. Are we still speeding up even though I've got very slight brakes on? That's impressive. This is a very sharp bend. Imagine going through this at high speed. We would not survive. This is where I tried to spawn to start off with, but one of the trains collided with me. So yeah. Not fun. Look, we're going into the deep abyss of the tunnel. I like how the red, the red lights on this one flash. That's pretty cool. In fact, we could probably watch them. Goodbye. Yeah, there it goes. Um, load please. There we go. Right, let's go. Speed limits just won't be a thing. We're just going to bomb it down. However, when we do get to Gravesend, I will slow down. Because it's quite a sharp bend. Again. Other than that, we should be going fine. What's the passenger view like? Quiet. Very, very quiet. Very, very nice, though. 
you know. Oh, you can look all the way around. That's a bit awkward. I am an owl. Or oh, it's just the exorcism. I let you can see the front of the train over there. And it's really loud over here. Well, not really loud, but there's sound. We are approaching Higham. This could be rather amusing. Have we got a cab light on this thing? I don't think we have. I would say no. That's not good. Oh well, never mind. Look at this now. We're already going 100 miles an hour. Oops, that wasn't a very good view. I don't even know what that view was. Doesn't matter, doesn't matter. There are some, yeah, there are some bends that we're going to have to be careful on, on this line. And if we if we do derail, I will continue from the closest station because I do want to make it if I can. There is another train coming. That won't be good. I want a straight piece of track. It's fine. Look at the speed now. 140 miles an hour already. That's as fast as we're allowed to go on the high speed line, and we're still going up. This is why this train is awesome. That's also why I'm going to bring the throttle down for this turn that's coming up. Does this train tilt? It makes sense if it did. Yes, it tilts. Actually, no, is that the track tilt? That might be the track tilting, actually. Going through a 70 at 140. Yeah, that's a safe idea. But now, it's sort of straight track now, so let's keep on accelerating. Look at this. In real life, this is full of freight trains and freight wagons, and it looks awesome. And this is empty and boring. Never mind. Literally, this is gonna this isn't gonna be much fun until we get to a really sharp bend. So just 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 sit back and enjoy the ride. Now nah, I'm joking. I will I will keep on talking, because you know otherwise I'm just being weird. So yeah. The, it says W sign, but e, like, I'm going to push the button right now. No sound. Just simply because, you know, it's being stupid. We're going 100 miles an hour over the limit. We have got a 50 coming up, so I, I will take the throttle down and put a bit of brake on for that. That's in a mile. I think I'll take the throttle off now. Put a bit of brake on might be necessary. Oh yeah, a lot of brake. Oh god, this isn't good. It gets a lot sharper than this in some places. We are surviving though. Yeah, this isn't going to be fun. Look at that bend up there. This, what's the back of the train like today? Ah, not bad. I do hope we can at least get onto the high speed line. That would be very embarrassing. If we do derail here, I'll start off in Gravesend. That's not good. We're really going over to the side. Eh. Are we going through the station? Or past the station? I think we're going past the station. Yeah, loop. We're going past the station. It's fine. We're not making any sudden turns to the left. Right. We're now going to go through at this speed until we get onto the high speed line because I know that we won't survive going down to Ebbsfleet at this speed. It's as simple as that. We're already meant to be only going 30 right now. This train just looks so awesome. It's amazing. I still haven't done any um, standard or career scenarios with it. I do plan to do that very soon. Do we even fit under the bridge? Barely. Barely. Never mind. We're now actually not speeding. How's that for you? Uh, stopping Ebb's fleet? Nah, that's not going to be a thing. What, flashing yellow lights. That can't be good. Please tell me that's just because we're turning off and for no other reason whatsoever. I do hope it's be just because we're turning off. I don't want to have to slam the emergency brakes on on this thing. There's another flashing... Um, hang on. Let's just, let's just check ahead a second. Just check ahead. Make sure there's no trains on the track anywhere. 
because we know what that we know what that's like in the past. Oh, there's another another signal. No, it looks clear. It's just want it just wants us to let us know that we're actually going onto this line here. We should watch it from here actually. That must be a very cool thing to see. So we'll turn that off and we'll wait for our train to come. Here it comes. Uh quite a speed that it should be going at. It should be going about 50 miles an hour right now. It's probably going about 80. Look at that. That is just amazing. Obviously I love trains. If you don't love trains it's not amazing at all to you. It's just a train. But to me it's awesome. Alright so yeah we just go, right, let's go past Ebsfleet International. Platform 5. And um, down we go into the high speed line, I guess. Which is basically just a load of tunnels. But it, it, this is when it gets interesting. Because this is when the throttle goes up. Well, once we've, once we've finished this turn here, the throttle will go up. Now oh, screw it, go up now. We're already going a lot faster than we should be. This is where the fun begins. Does the pantograph even touch? I don't. I don't even know. Um. Hmm. That'd be something to figure out, I guess. How does one? Um. Ah, there we go. Oh, look, the pantograph does touch. Right, into the thing, because otherwise we can't do anything. Right, 140 is the limit on this line. So let's see how much we can beat that by. Well, we're already 10 miles off the limit. We're not speeding though. Right, anything now is too fast from now. There we go. Let's just see how fast we can get this thing to go. In fact, I'm going to turn that off so we can't see. We're going to look up. Alright, so we can't see what the speed is. We'll check the speed when we get out of this tunnel. See how much of it we've gained. This train's bouncing a lot. That's not something that should happen. However, this line is quite bumpy for a newly built line. So, um... Yeah, fun to be had there. Actually, if we go into that one, we can't tell what the speed is until we get out the tunnel. I'm going to go with bloody fast. Yep, yeah, right, we're outside the tunnel. How fast are we going? 163. I was expecting it to be a bit more than that. Come on, this can go faster. I know it can go faster. Ugh, I just went through the bridge. No, never mind. Look at that. It's just amazing. I know I keep on saying that, but it, it truly is. It is for me. Right. How fast are we going now? 180. Yeah, oh god, there's another train. Please don't die. There it goes. See, that's the ones we usually collide with, because that's only going about 20 miles an hour right now. So those are the ones we normally have a problem with in going the other direction. Are we nearly at 200 miles an hour? We should not be going this fast. No, 180, 100, and um, what is the limit on this bit? It's actually 186 for the Euro Stars, but they ne they never go that fast because they always have to slow down. And there, here comes another train. Let's go through it this time, shall we? Yeah. Awesome. We have broken 200 miles an hour. Somehow, I don't think we're going to survive this journey. I know it's high speed like a high speed line but I just don't I, some, something tells me that some part we're not going to survive especially when we come out of the tunnel at um, St Pancras that goes down to a 40 mile an hour limit then 25 oh dear oh dear indeed it's a very nice cab though I've got to say I just can't read anything because it's all in Chinese but never mind I'm sure it just as long as I know where the go button is it doesn't really matter we're going so quick that this isn't loading properly. See, look, that train's barely moving. And that's the one we usually collide with, I think. Yeah, it must be. It's just barely moving. Because they spawn out of the um, out of the place where they're meant to spawn. But they they don't spawn with any speed. Because they've only just added rolling starts into the game. So that's, that's, that's not good. Oh, wow, they're, they're actually there in real life. That's really cool. And they're actually spinning, too. That sun's really, um, looks really tiny today. 
Unless it's just me. Okay, back into the tunnel we go. Let's watch it from the back of the train. We are going at 230 miles an hour. I don't think we should be going that fast. And the speed is still going up. Holy crap. Look at the mileage go down. That's just ridiculous. Um, yeah. Wow, this is, um, this is quite fast. I haven't actually got it this fast before. Whoa, we're, we're going over to the side a bit. We shouldn't be doing this. I think we are actually tipping. It's just the tunnel that's keeping us in, in track. On track, whatever, doesn't matter. Okay. When we get to Stratford, I certainly hope we're going through and not turning off onto a platform because if we turn off onto a platform we will die just saying that now if I see a little if I see green instead of orange appear on, on the track map I will put the brakes on because we will not survive at this speed if it puts us onto a platform okay we're now going 100 miles an hour over the limit that, that, that can't be good that really can't be good yep we, we are still tilting quite a bit too much there. And the frame rate's starting to die because we're actually going too quickly for this route. But, you know, it's all part of the fun. Whoa, that's quite sharp for the speed we're going at. Oh dear. Just watching all the signals come and go, you know, as, as we rocket past them. What's it like from here? Uh, very bumpy. Too bumpy. I don't like that. Back here. Actually, let's do, let's do this. I, I said let's do this. There you go, look, we can look at the back of the train. Ta-da! How awesome is that? <coughs> oh, sorry about that. Frame rate's back. It wants us to stop. 245 miles an hour. I'm going to take the throttle off and put a bit of brake on. Because it wants us to stop. We will not survive going onto platform 2. And you'll... Oh, screw it. And we're just going to go. We'll restart from Stratford because I do want to get all the way to St Pancras. On this very video. But you will see that we will not survive as we enter Stratford International. As you can see now. Tilt over to the side. Oh, we did survive. Oh, no, we didn't. No, we didn't. Oops. <laughs> we just derailed the other train. Brilliant. Fantastic. Right, okay. Let's um go from Stratford to St Pancras and let's just do that again. Just to just to finish the route off, you know. Because why not? Oh come on game load. Right, well we're back at Stratford, we're going to head to Thingy Madubri Flip. We're not going to crash into this train this time, so sorry about that. You're only pulling away and we just murdered you. Where are you headed anyway? That side says Ashford, this side says... Um... Raynham, you're going to Raynham, have fun with that. Well, through that, through that, round that, through the train, right. Okay. Right, well, let's just, let's just get on with it. The whole point is, I want to see... How quickly I can get into St Pancras because there's a, there's a 25 mile an hour limit. I want to see how quickly I can do that. So if we derail before, not, I'll just I'll keep I won't record this bit again. I'll just get to the exit of um, the tunnel and we'll just see how quickly we can actually take it. That sounds so wrong. 
Never mind. Uh, there we go. There should be a view and a half. The lights aren't on, are they? There we go. Lights are on now. In it goes. Into the tunnel of death. Well, it will be the tunnel of death if I'm not careful. And off they go. Have a, have a good time. Have a good time. How fast are we going over at sea? Look, well, we're not we're not beating the speed limit yet, but see, look, the kilometers an hour thing goes up to 400. That 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 can't be good. That seriously can't be good. So yeah, we're continuing on our journey after smashing into the um, smashing into the side of um, Stratford. I was hoping the crash would be a little bit more spectacular, actually, but you know. That's just me being, um, you know, a bloodthirsty idiot. Who knows? Do, 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 do. Come on, break the speed limit. I want to have some fun. I don't want to get there and still be under the limit. Oh, we've still got four miles to go. We'll be fine. We can get this thing up to quite a speed in that time, surely. At least I hope we can. I want to have some fun, like I just said. So what does this thing say over here? 81... 105 is different. I don't think that works. I'm just going to go with it now. There we go. We're speeding. I am a happy mole man. What's this thing? A cab lights? Is there not a sign for cab lights? What's that one? Reverse that. No, I don't want to touch that. We don't want to touch cruise. No, I don't want to touch cruise. Uh, it's a bit bumpy. Headlight control. Yeah, we don't want that. Cab light. It did not fall. Well, that's handy, isn't it? I think our bulb's broken. Oh, okay, there's the 40. There's the 40. Right, here's where the fun begins. Let's see how quickly we can pull into the station and stop. Let's, you know, without smashing into the front. I don't fancy destroying this station. It's a very nice station. Right, let's take the throttle down to about 50% now. That'll do. Um... Are we still speeding up? No, uh, are we? I think, yeah, we're still speeding up. Sort of. Speed sort of leveled off slightly. Right, okay, now the throttle's going to come off. There we go, throttle's off. God, this train's bumping about a bit, in it? My goodness. How are we still alive? Right, we're coming into platform 12. That's not what I wanted. I wanted platform 6. Because it's longer. It's like twice as long. I could have more time to stop, but such is life. We'll just deal with it. Okay, we've got we've got the 40 limit coming up, so we are going to start applying some brake. We're going to start applying a little bit more brake. Oh, the frame rate's caught up with us. Wow, we're going fast. The frame rate, just seen how fast we're actually going. Whoa, bumpy, bumpy, bumpy. It's bumpy. Oh, God, we're not going to survive this. Oh, my God. Yeah, no. Oops. <laughs> The train was just like, nope, I want to be Kerbal Space Program. <laughs> just shot off into the sky. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, well what I'm going to do is I'm going to... I'm, I'm going to um, cut it here and I'll see you when I'm about to exit the tunnel again. Very quickly, I thought I'd just show off this view. I mean, look at that. That's, that's the, without zooming out, that's the view you get of the train when you push number two. You have to zoom out to get a normal view, otherwise you just get a big nose in your face. Just thought I'd point that out. Right, I've brought you back just when we've started to go start speeding thing. Yeah, right. How fast were we going last time? Because we need to be going slower than that. I actually can't remember. We'll, we'll take it at the speed limit, I think. Yeah, we'll take it at the speed... We'll go at the speed limit for now. We'll, we'll just go at the speed limit and see if we can survive at the speed limit. I don't want to slow down though. We'll just leave it on 6% throttle for now. If we can survive on the speed limit 100 miles an hour faster, then that's pretty that's pretty good. It's pretty good indeed. Oh, here it comes. The 40 mile an hour speed limit then goes down to 25. Which could be amusing. Train, don't slow down that much. Jesus Christ. I want to have some fun. We're not speeding anymore. Right. Yeah, I don't know how fast we were going last time, but it was too fast. 
I know there's normally no such thing as too fast and you know you get everyone to say speed is the best or speed is key and stuff like that but sometimes speed can be a little bit too much you know just just a tad just a tad so we're just gonna take a, a, a fast slow speed there you go I guess or a slow fast speed I don't know whatever we are slowing down way too much for my liking Ah, oh, 125 will do Let's drop the throttle do we survive? I don't think we're still not going to survive, are we? No, not going to survive. Are we going to do a big thing again? Is the train going to loop up forwards? Oh, look, we're still practically on the track, look. That sucks. You know what? I don't think this can be done at this speed. Okay. Okay, I'm going to go with 90. All right, we're going to go to 90 miles an hour as we exit. Okay, see you in a minute. Okay, right, St Pancras is about to appear on the map, at least I, I assume it is by the track rapidly going up. Yep, there it is. So we are going to go in at 90 miles an hour. By the way, if it doesn't work, if I can't get it to work at 90, we're going to get to um, this, this this signal we're about to approach now and put the emergency brakes on. Actually, no, that might be a bit too much. we will probably be too slow then. I'm hoping 90 miles an hour can do it. It's only a 40 speed limit. If I can get round a 70 and a 30, I don't see what's wrong with getting round a 40 and a 90. Wow, this is bumpy. Oh dear. We are slowing down in time though, by the looks of things. Yep. Just about to hit 100 miles an hour. Indeed. Alright, let's take the throttle off. We'll slow down in our own time, thank you very much. We are going to slow down as we go around the bend. I don't even know if we're going to survive yet. I hope we do, come on. It can't be that difficult. It's only a turn. This turns, I think this turns the main killer of the rest of the train. Here we go, here we go. Right, where's our train? There it is. Right, come on. Make it. Now that's what I am on about. It went kind of went through at about just under 80. But that is what I am on about. Oh god. Oh. Oh, and just fall off the track as well, yeah, why don't you? Oh, for God's sake. I give up. I give up. It can't be done. We're going to have to go through at a really slow speed once that. We can get out, but we can't get through. Never mind. It was an interesting test. You have to actually obey the speed limits once you get to St Pancras. Never mind. Do you know what, actually? One last thing we're going to do. We are going to go to quick drive. We're going to do this in the other direction and smash into a train. As is the normal. Why can you hear sirens? They haven't stopped yet, have they, from loading St Pancras and London. Right, never mind. We're going to do the whole thing where we go from St Pancras and smash into another train because this thing goes so fast. It'd be so funny. Let's just go and do it now. Okay, welcome to St Pancras International. As you can see, it's a lovely station. Once again, we are going to do our... There's the big nose thing again. We're going to do our classic run to Ebbsfleet, but not make it that far because a train spawns and only goes about 20 miles an hour. But because we're in this train that goes super fast, it's going to be hilarious. Let's just go. Actually, can we go this way without derailing? That's a fun point. Let's have a look round, shall we? Just whilst that train takes off. Literally, probably. Where's this train going? See, this is there's meant to be Eurostars here. And there aren't any. They haven't put any in the game. That side cannot be going to Stratford. You lying. Right. We beat our train over here, and this side's not in use. Hmm. You're being a bit odd, train. Also, that's not that fence is higher in real life. I'll be going too fast now. No, don't save. No, cancel. We're probably going too fast now. Do 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 do. Look at that. Too bad it can't stay on the tracks around here. Holy shit! This is quite it's quite tight. We're going at 70, round of 25, yet we couldn't survive 70, round of 40. You know what? I'm not going to question it. Uh, how did we survive that? I don't know. Yeah, look, the, track, the train starts to come off the tracks then. Alright, let's go. Let's just go, 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 go. What I am going to do is... Um, I will do a jump at some point so we can watch the train go past Stratford at a very high speed for the lols. So once we get reach up to speed, I will then, you know, jump ahead to um, Stratford and watch it go 
Meow. Because that'd be hilarious. Well, not hilarious. But it'll be funny. No, it won't be funny. It'll just be awesome. Yeah, we'll go with awesome. I don't know my English today. Down, down, deeper and down. Here we go. And that's the speed limit, right? There's the bottom of the tunnel, right there. Then we start going up again. Ebb's fleet is in 20 miles. We're not going to make 20 miles. I'm telling you now. Dooby doo. Oh, this is fun, isn't it? What do the passengers think of today? Oh, there aren't any. Can we change the view in here? Yes, we can sit on the other side for the win. This is the best train ever. You can sit on the other side. I'm lying, of course. You know, you can do that in other trains. But this is a really cool train because of how fast it goes. Nearly at the bottom of the tunnel and we're going 166. Nice. Nice indeed. Anyway, I'm going to leave you here and I'll see you when we get to Stratford. Alright, welcome to Stratford. We're standing on the most pointless platform ever built. And um, our train's going to come out of that tunnel. Let's go past and go into this tunnel. Yeah, this, this platform's never used. Which is kind of stupid, if you ask me. Here comes our train. That's pretty fast. That looks so cool. I'm so glad we didn't turn off and derail then. I'm gonna say it. Right. How fast are we going? Ooh, 210 miles an hour, as you do. Right, okay. Yeah, we're gonna smash into a train, aren't we? And it's gonna be fun. It's always fun. It's always for the good old times, you know. When I didn't realise it was actually going to happen. But now we know it's going to happen. But it will still be hilarious. Because the train will still probably flail about in some sort of dramatic show of it being killed or something. Go, oh, what have you done to me? You know, so, um, yeah. Yeah, indeed. 222. Two, two. That can't be good. <gasps> We don't want to go 222. Two, two. There we go. 223. That's a lot better. That's a lot better. We can relax now. Let's turn that off because I want I want to see this in an awesome way once we get out the tunnel. Right. Cover cover your cover your ears. <coughs> I'm so sorry. I'm perfectly healthy. I, I I honestly I'm not ill or anything. I'm seriously not ill. I'm just dying for some reason. Why does that thing Why does that thing say 41 kilometers an hour? We are not going 41 kilometers an hour. If that's what this train thinks, then this train needs something fixing. Like, it's everything in a couple of minutes. Because we know for a fact that we are going to hit a train. And it is going to hurt. This driver will not survive, neither will anyone in the train. But, it will still be hilarious. And we shall enjoy it. How fast are we going? 232. Hmm. Yeah, the speed's still going up. This is quite a sharp bend, isn't it? Come on, frame rate. I know you're loading fast because I know you're. The, you know you meant. The, 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 you know what I mean. I've said it before. We're going too fast for this scenario to load thingy, but you know, catch up. Come on, this is for YouTube, man. Do yourself proud. I'm showcasing you on an, on the internet. No, fine. Just be laggy. No problem. So, I like how this train shows you where the pantographs are and the names of things. 01020304050060700. That's the logic. Oh, is that the name of the train? That's the name of the train right there. The, um, the CRH380D. And this is number 6601, I think. I think that's how it works. Oh, here we go. This is where the fun begins. Right, let, me have, let me have an outside view, please. This will be fun. I don't know how fast we're going. Let's find out. 236 miles an hour. Yeah, this train that we're about to find is screwed. I think we're going a lot faster than we were last, last time on this piece of track. I can't remember. And it was only a few minutes ago. That's not good for my memory. Oh, well, never mind. Alright, where's this train? Are we even going to survive get into this train? Yeah, we should do. We're only banking a little bit. Where is it? Oh, Mr. Train, where are you? Well, that just loaded. Thanks for that. It's fine. There you are. Hello, you just spawned. Fantastic. Here's where the fun begins. Let's zoom out for the fun. 
and boom. Look at that. That's the <laughs> we literally combined the two trains. Yes, I gathered there was a collision. Thanks for that. Thanks for informing me. When two trains love each other very much, they get themselves in a knot like snakes do, by the looks of things. Isn't that always fun to do? I love that. Right, I think that's been enough um, derailment and fun for today. So, um, thanks for watching everyone. I've been the Mole Man. Please comment, like, favourite and subscribe if you haven't already. If you have already, I love you. If you haven't, subscribe and then I'll love you. Yeah, there you go, that's how it works. So, um, yeah. Um, next, I don't know what I'll be doing. Probably something that involves more speed than we were last time. You'd be wondering, how is that possible? Well, I'm telling you, it is most certainly possible. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.